Good afternoon. Oh, it's morning. <laughs> we just woke up, as you can tell, because I'm not as pretty as I usually am. I'm pretty sure you look the exact same. No, nah, I'm still pretty. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Jackson jumped up on bed and like gave me a link to say hello. And I was like, hey, buddy, got up, went upstairs to get reception on my phone, booked someone into my Airbnb back in Australia. A lot of people say, how do you afford this? And I, we actually make money from our little investment apartment back home in Australia that we Airbnb. So I run that from the boat. We should put a link in there. If anyone who goes to Australia when they finally open up, no. Let right, you know. it's Adelaide, which isn't Ah, oh, whatever. You want to go to Adelaide? Go to Adelaide when Australia opens up. We set our Airbnb. So anyway, we're going to go for a walk now anyway. Drink this coffee. Give Jackson his brekkie. This place looks absolutely incredible. So. Ryan, I wouldn't call it a hike. We're wearing flip-flops. Good morning, everyone. Look at how wonderful I look today. My coffee has not kicked in I think many Jackson just found a little baby one. He sniffed it out. He's a genius. Hey, mate. How you going? Hi, my name's Franklin. <laughs> Alright, let's go back to where we were today and explore these caves. These two guys are going to have a heart attack. They're swimming up with yeah. snorkel gear underwater to a bunch of naked hot chicks. You didn't realize I think it's like a nudist beach or it's just a Spanish thing. Never seen so many like <laughs> perfect bodies but ass naked. It's usually the wrinkly old dudes with their balls oh, out that we It see. is actually. This girl was doing the downward facing dog and whatever stretch that is where your legs are out and you put your head between your legs, she was doing that butt naked. Kid, and people were walking in from the trail and I said, Ryan, they're literally walking into her All right, Let's go, let's go, come on. Come on, you can do it. It's always harder with the Oh yeah, come on, you just try to get a rest now. Yeah, I'll show you how it's done. <laughs> hey, do you reckon we could climb up here? No! Ryan's got a clever idea. I give that one a 10 out of 10. That sounded like it hurt. It was my flat feet. Oh, how do you feel? That was a lot easier than the one we did with Ian and Ralph. <laughs> that was good. A few more of them and then we'll go to lunch. Oh, there's light under there. Oh, that could be the one. Let's go. Drop the anchor, drop the anchor. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Oh, 
wish I could hear again. Just on the other side. <laughs> See, I was on the other side of that rock just there. Oh, I couldn't. Climb up there. I bet you could just jump off that. All right, let's go back. Come on, sweet cheeks. One, two, two, three. three. What? Look at my ass! Why do you have water in there? I couldn't see! She said her butt can't get underwater and then she's literally her bum's like floating up against the buddy. I couldn't the, see! Uh, I was trying to find the pencil! I scratched my leg! I almost just died! <laughs> oh, guys it's been a wicked anchorage here it's been amazing actually i got a massive migraine i think when i went for cliff jumping yesterday i got water up my nose and it's been killing me okay anyway, so i just jumped off the cliff all right let's see hold on yeah i think the other ones have bailed i don't think they're going to jump i think he's chickened out Brittany. you ready Brittany? no Super productive with her uh, messy desk. I right? have been. All you've done is gotten out of bed into your ass and taken the dog for a walk. Look at that kitchen woman. That's because her water <laughs> doesn't work. Oh, it's so bad. So my water pump's still broken. I've probably said this a million times this week. So we're heading to Palmer. So I think I've got the engine warming up. What I'm going to do is I'll hold this water pressure down again and we'll do all the dishes. In under 48 hours, we'll be in Palmer, which has all the yachting chandleries and everything there. So we can, we can buy a new water pump and we can oh, be done no. with it. Well, yesterday would have been perfect to sail, but I wasn't feeling very well because I had like massive sinuses all blocked from the cliff jumping. I think that's what it was anyway. We're heading off today. Unfortunately though, we've got like three knots of wind on our nose. <laughs> it's got to rain all day too. I don't know, we're going to struggle. We have to go into a marina because we've got to sort out this water pump problem. That being winter, things are a lot cheaper too for us. So anyway, yeah, that's uh, that's where we're at right now. We'll work something out. We'll just see. What is it? The world is our oyster? So the world is our Beneteau. <laughs> Ryan has been dying to put our winter covers up since we had them in Ma made in Tunisia for our Atlantic crossing. And like in the middle of July, he's like, come on, Brittany, let's put them up. I'm like, no, Ryan, it's going to be too hot. We'll end up like in a hot box. Then August came, come on, Brittany, let's do it. No, Ryan, relax. We're surrounded by rain clouds and it's just starting. when it rains, I want to put them up. So Ryan's convinced me to get the winter covers out. Here he goes. He's so excited. We got one down. How good is that? I'm so excited. <laughs> da, 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 so da, and here. I just can't hide. Da, 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 da. <laughs> All right. So now we have our own little room. <laughs> One of the big reasons we wanted this was just for safety across the Atlantic. Especially having Jackson, just wanted to have a fully enclosed cockpit that was secured down to the deck. Got the button snaps, which are pretty strong, but also we have secondary Velcro to just hold it in place. For our own safety and peace of mind, for our family's peace of mind, because they're quite nervous about us crossing the Atlantic. In Tunisia, we got it for such a good price. It was only a couple hundred dollars. For the money we paid, it's insane. We would have never been able to get otherwise. Man, this is epic. Now Brittany's cleaning it. <laughs> Man, this is going to be so amazing having this up now in the winter. So happy. <laughs> All right, it's raining. Jack said it's raining, buddy. Woo! And I'm dry. <laughs> Poor baby. It's raining. Brian's literally traumatized the dog. 
it's so good because right now we'd be like, oh shit, like get our jackets, we'd be hiding in here, we'd be packing these up, we'd be covering everything up. But here we are. What are all these guys doing over here now, huh? They're probably all soaking wet, huh? I bet you they have a fully functioning water pump. Yeah, they probably do. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Don't forget where you came from. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And you didn't even have a spray hood to protect you. Oh no. Oh, it's so dry and warm, buddy. Ryan's stressing because our dinghy's probably filling up with lots of rain. Oh my god. We're gonna slow down and Ryan's gonna. Yeah, she's full alright, eh? In a torrential downpour, it doesn't quite cut the mustard. Because the bin is three years old now, so once we spray it with some waterproof spray, I think we'll be sweet. The only issue we're having is the seams along this are leaking. Are leaking. You can see drops coming down. All right. Well, we made it. We ended up going way further than we expected. We're in Palmum. Good morning, everyone. It's been a shit night. Well, it's been a shit morning. Since about 3.30 in the morning, it started rocking and rolling like crazy. So we've been up and down all night. But Ryze just did some witchcraft and wizardry that I honestly still, no matter how many times he explains it, I don't understand how it works. So I'm getting him to draw it for me. Yeah. All right, Don't so. mind me, I haven't had my coffee yet. So basically, now if the wind's blowing this way, we're pulling on the chain right here. If we put another anchor point here and we tie this to the chain here, if this here is say like 10 meters and this line here is 20 meters, if we tighten this chain to be 10 meters, then the back is gonna swing around and this is gonna tighten up, it's gonna pull here. So then this is 10 meters and that's 10 meters, which means looking down on the boat and we're pulling on the anchor but then the load spread out across the chain and the rope but in doing that swells coming this way we're facing the swell do you get it now or not yeah no just say how awesome i am yes you're awesome yeah. i told you that sound god sound god just say it once i'm god <laughs> <laughs> say it okay just say hercules no i'll oh, say something you're say good it. you're good thank you thank you <laughs> we've got a patreon chat this morning and uh the swell is rolling into this anchorage i mean look at this boat here the master's going like this. So we're sitting here trying to set up for this Patreon chat this morning. We're just like this and, and everything's sliding off the table. Doors are slamming, the dishes are clunking around. So I was like, all right, Brandy, now this is bullshit. So this is a good little tip for you guys. Such a simple little trick. What I've done is just dropped another probably 10 meters of chain out. I've tied another line to it and that's tied to the back cleat and they meet in the middle here like a V. I got probably 10 meters of line. So now I've got the boat facing the swell. So now we're just kind of gently bobbing up and down with the swell rather than being side onto it, rocking and rolling like these other boats are. Oh, uh, Rick taught me that. I'm slow star, thanks Rick. So we just did our Patreon chat and it was so cool. We did a Zoom chat. Oh, like we're just sitting out at the pub having a beer. Now I feel like we go way back, eh? <laughs> Don't you reckon? It's so cool. I love it. Anyway, so we're leaving now. Actually, you know, this is really cool. So Steve and Trace from um, Sailing Dusk on the ML that we spent a lot of time with in Sicily and Tunisia. Their son lives over here in Parma. We're going to catch up today and say hi. So we just dropped anchor on the other side of the bay. So we'll let Nicholas and Sean, we'll let them introduce themselves then. We're going to pick them up now from the beach. Jackson's excited to meet the Bells 2.0. Tracy and Steve, you've been replaced. Jackson, who's that? Hi, Jackson. I'm <laughs> Get back. You guys gotta introduce yourselves, all right? Oh, no. <laughs> no what what, what, what right. are we supposed to say? Hi, I'm Nick. Yeah. <laughs> Sean. There we go. So this is a Steve and Tracy 2.0. Yeah. <laughs> we got to see if you guys are more fun though, because like they drink hard. Just saying, just putting that one out I'll there. Put it this no, way. no, no. They already arrived, arrived in style, hey? <laughs> oh man, welcome to Sunday. <laughs> Guys, how do you feel? Yeah. yeah. Better now, my feet are on the ground. Yeah, yeah. You got it. You got it. Yeah, yeah. Hey, you're on land, buddy. 
<laughs> he didn't enjoy that sale. It was short and sharp, I'd say, and choppy. You get that a lot around here, mate. And these guys were shitting themselves when I was pulling into the berth here. Yeah, right. <laughs> we got the super yacht captain here, stressing out, going, oh man, does Ryan know what he's doing? <laughs> <laughs> now, you know, it was all good. We hit the few boats on the way in, but it's all good. So now, I think you should get ready and go check out Palmer. Airbnb is where you rent your home out and stuff. Good I think little... everybody knows what Airbnb is. Oh, okay. You ready? When this is gone, you can start talking to me. <laughs> oh, no. I don't kick up so much. Um, <laughs> you know, just like this, like... Yeah. <laughs> so we found another cave and somebody There's probably heaps of caves camping in there. <laughs> hey, the vagabonds from Adelaide, so there you go. We get two of the top YouTube channels in the world are oh, from Adelaide. <laughs> Selling Sunday and La Vagabond. And we can be done with it. Work right now. What password do we put in to get into this computer? Oh, he's running! I'm fast as boy. Still fast as boy. Come get some. <laughs> 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 